It's a new dawn, a new day, a new era. And Lyle Taylor is still in the background of my videos. Let me just fix that real quick. <sighs> Perfection. Sandy people, how are you doing? And welcome back to another live reaction. Lincoln City versus Charlton Athletic. It's going to be a very tough game today for the Addicts. Lincoln, of course, have got off to a very good start to the season. They've got some good players that are definitely going to cause us problems. They've started the season strong and they're going to be a tough side to beat. Charlton, the Thomas Sangard era has begun at Charlton and we're looking to kick it off in style. New signings, Ben Watson and Akin Famuo will be available today and I'm looking forward to seeing them both play. Of course, Alex Gilby is injured, but Watson, perfect replacement for him. Famuo, a much needed addition in the back line. We needed to tighten that defence. I'm going to be optimistic today. I'm going to go with a 2-1 win to kick off the Sandgard era. Lincoln won't make it easy for us, but come on boys. Let's kick off our new era in style. Let's get those three points. Come on you Reds! Game is now underway. Come on you Reds! Let's go. Let's kick off the Sandgard era in style. We're in our third kit, the blue number, which I have kind of a love-hate relationship. I... Not the biggest fan of it, but I feel like it may grow on me as the season goes on. Akin Famuo, by the way, is absolutely massive. He's absolutely huge. Six foot three, 21. He is built like a unit. As Washington's played in, Washington has a chance. Oh, no! Connor Washington fires wide. That came literally out of nowhere. I was just talking about how big Akin Famuo is. We get played through a long ball over the top from Amos, I think it was. Doughty headed it down. Then Connor Washington got played through. He cut inside into the penalty area on his right foot and he's had a shot at the near post and it's just skimmed the post. It's so close. Inches from finding the corner. Bloody hell boys. Unlucky. From what the commentators have been saying, I agree with. It's a very high tempo game. The ball's been moved around very quickly. Both teams showing an intent to break each other down quickly and with a lot of pace. And It's been a good start from both teams. Charlton, we've, we've been looking good, man. We've been looking good. Winning the ball in the air, flicking it onto our players and we're doing quite well. Looking at this starting 11, I'm actually impressed with it and I do think that based off this starting 11, the only problem that needs to be fixed is right back with Barker, of course, playing out of position. So we do need a right back in that position. Overall though, other than the right back, this starting 11 is very strong and I'm, looking, I'm loving this starting 11. But it's the right back and of course the depth in the team as well that needs improving. As a long ball over the top left from Amos. Bond managed to left it to Alfie Doughty. Doughty has a shot and that's gone into Rose's head. Been a very positive start there from Charlton once again though. We're looking very, very good. It's been a high tempo game as I've said. Both teams have started quite strong. But if any team deserves to be in front at the moment, I'd say Charlton. Now Prattley to Dylan Levitt through the centre. Levitt with a rather aggressive ball towards Doughty which goes and miss. Levitt's been very shaky so far. I've not liked Dylan so far. He seems to be... He's probably nervousness, to be totally honest. What's a ball there by Doughty towards Oztuma? Oztuma, bends a shot, good save. Washington, you've got to put that away. Come on, ref. He goes down. Doughty picks it back up, though. Come on. Come on. Purrington. Doughty. Swing it in. He gets it in. Good ball. Ref. Goes down again. Barker. Levitt's on the edge of the area. Levitt and Barker keeps going. Crosses it in, cleared away, and cleared away by Bridcut. Unlucky. Comes back to Washer Larger though. Now to Dylan Levitt. This is good. Come on. Come on. Charlie Barker. Oz Tuma. Barker. Levitt. Levitt on the right side. Pings it back in towards Washington, who's unmarked on the back post. Play it back. Bond. Come on. Bond's there. McCauley Bond. He's got to finish this. Come on. Who's there? Help him out. Come on. Oz Tuma. Ah, oh, blocked. Bloody hell, boys. Come on. We're going very close, man. Prattley, now to Doughty on the left side. Come on, Alfie. Perrin on the overlap. He doesn't use him. He tries to cut inside. Ref! Free kick. Well done. Ayoma brings him down. There's a free kick. Perfect opportunity. So many opportunities there in quick succession from Charlton. Oh, we're the team on top. We're the team on top. We've definitely been looking good. Lincoln, they've had a couple of chances which have blazed over the bar and have come offside. But some really good chances there from Charlton. We really needed to put it away. Lincoln have won themselves a free kick. Round about 30 yards out from goal. Good chance here on the right foot. It was Charlie Barker who conceded the foul. Good chance here from Lincoln. He will go for goal. He goes towards the far corner, but it does go wide. The goalkeeper had a half corner for Come on, does he get this in? Goes towards the edge of the area. And Jesus Christ. 
Oh, it's another corner. Okay, we'll take that. <laughs> Interesting tactic there. Was Tuma played it out to the edge of the area as Dylan Levitz had a shot on the volley that was going well wide, but it took a deflection. It's gone out for another corner. Was Tuma lays it off short this time. Levitt with another shot. Oh, hello. Oh, my word. Jesus Christ. We laid it off short this time. Doughty was the one who played it out to the edge of the area to Levitt. Levitt's had a shot from range. It takes a deflection from the Lincoln player. A nasty deflection. It caught the keeper off guard. Keeper went the wrong way and it nearly deflected into the back of the net. We're coming really, really close here. An interesting corner tactic there, playing that's the edge of the area to Levitt. First one didn't really work out, went up for another corner. Second one very nearly caught out the Lincoln players. Oh, was too much. Come on, Nahan. Come on, he has a shot. No. Blocked again. Come on, man. Another unbelievable chance. It was a fantastic tackle from Prattley on the right and left side. Played it into Doughty from the tackle. Doughty sprinted past the Lincoln players. He's pulled it across the box towards Ostuma. Got it on his right foot, his weak foot. Has a shot blocked by the Lincoln defender. Come on, boys. We've been absolutely all over Lincoln. We've been absolutely all over him. Completely dominated him. Ostuma lays it off from the corner to Levin, who lays it off to the edge of the area way back towards Charlie Barker who pings it back in that's a good ball what a ball Perrington no for a goal kick to Lincoln City and yet again 50 pence Edmund free kick for Lincoln George Grant with the cross but he hell Jesus no 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 how? George Grant swung it in, it was a good delivery. There's apparently been a push in the box, I can't see, I couldn't see it. I saw Rocha Larger go down with their striker, right before half time as well. Come on Amos man, do a job, do a job son. Yes! Yes Amos! No! Wait a minute. Charlton players have gone over to the linesman. The referee's gone over to the linesman to say was it offside or not. It was saved by Amos. It was a great save. And the goal's been given. Bowyer is absolutely fuming, as is the players. It was saved brilliantly by Amos. It came back out to Tom Anderson, apparently. They both went for the same ball. It's then flipped back over. George Grant has then just stabbed it in. That is their first shot on target in the whole game. That's the best chance they've had all game. And that's half time. Lincoln City won, Charlton are playing nil. What is that about, man? What is that? I need to see the penalty again, because I don't, I don't know. I didn't see what it was given for. Penalty was given. George Grant stepped up, saved brilliantly by Amos. Came back out to Anderson. Then it was flicked in, stabbed in by Grant. Boyer is absolutely doing his nut. He's complaining to the referee right now, completely doing his not shouting at him. We've had countless amount of opportunities, we've looked such an aerial threat, their defence has been caught out so many times by us. They've had such a shaky backline all game. We've been playing the long balls over to Doughty, Washington, Bond. We've been flicking the balls on, winning the headers, playing it into each other. Oz Toomer's had a good chance, Levitt's had a good chance. We've completely commanded the game and then we get that. We need to get our act together now. We need to find this equaliser and then we need to get this win which you deserve. We deserve to be winning this game. We should be winning this game. Come on Alfie. Alfie puts it in. Nice cross. Bond, no! Bond can't, can't get it underway. Come on Washington. Come on. Right side of the area. Help him out. Help him. That's it. Barker. No! Come on. Come on! Oz Tuma. Come on, Irvin. Help him. Bon. Ozzy. Washington. Oh, in the penalty area. No. Again, another chance in the penalty area. Come on. Need to start taking your chances. If you don't take your chances, you don't win games. We need to take our chances. A good opportunity again there. But come on, boys. Come on! Here comes the interesting substitution with Charlton now. Akin Famowo, our new sign-in from Norwich, has come off. I thought he had an okay game. He did all right, actually. He's been replaced by our other new sign-in, Ben Watson. Come on, Ben, let's see how you can do, mate. We need his experience in the midfield. He'll be a very good player for us. Great little pick-up from Forrest. Let's see what he can do. Just over 25 minutes left to play. Lincoln still 1-0 up. 
Charlton looking for that equaliser, an equaliser that we need badly. We've been the team on top, we've been the better team, there's no question about it. That first half absolutely dominated them, couldn't take our chances. Washington with a great chance in the first opening five minutes. Oz Toomer had a good chance, Levitt had a good chance, we've had multiple opportunities, just not taken. And then a very, very controversial goal apparently, penalty drama and Lincoln get their goal. And now we need to bounce back and fast. Levitt plays it out right to Oshilaja. Oshilaja down the right to Barker. Barker whips it in. Ostuma, ah, Ostuma can't get his head to it. Bond can't either. Ah, this is infuriating. Ah, oh, another good ball in from Barker. Ostuma couldn't quite get, it, get his foot to it. Bond, I think, got a touch to it, but it was caught by Alex Palmer. This could quite possibly be the most infuriating game I've watched in a long bloody time, man, seriously. How many chances or opportunities are we going to have in front of goal and we're just not taking them? This is so frustrating to watch. Lincoln have a poor chance again. No, oh my God. Ball in across the box there from Lincoln. Barker managed to get a touch to it. It come off their player and out for a goal kick. But this is bloody frustrating to watch, man. We've had so many chances. Dominated possession. Moving the ball nicely. Getting forward well. Putting those balls in the box. It's just the final ball and the end product just is not there. You know, come on. Swing that in. Good ball. Ostuma, why are you trying to head it? You're five foot three, mate. Why are you trying to go for a header? Good ball again, though. Now, come on. We're finding those balls out the left. Go on! Ah. 12 minutes to get an equaliser. Come on, boys. We should not be behind. We should not be losing this game. That's going to be it, I think. We've run out of ideas. The story of our game, literally, we get the ball inside the penalty area very easily. Lincoln's defence fall asleep. We get the ball in the box, and then we don't know what to do with it, and then we give it away and mess it up. That's been the story of our game. What are we doing? We're actually we're throwing it away, lads. We're falling asleep, throwing it away. This has been such a frustrating game to watch. It's been so frustrating. Balls in from the corner. Back post header. We've thrown it. We've thrown it. We've absolutely thrown it. 2 0 Lincoln. Lincoln. And just so I'm going to tell you. Corners in by Grant, back post to their goal. What are we doing? We just fell asleep and gifted them that corner. What the actual f are we doing? Well done, lads. Well done. Well done. Absolutely thrown it. Well done. Fucking alright! Full time. Lincoln City 2, Charlton Athletic 0. A penalty decision that was controversial to say the least and a back post header from us falling asleep is the difference first half absolutely dominated them absolutely controlled the game had so many chances through Washington or Tuma Levitt we had chances didn't take them and then they get a free kick they get a penalty from that free kick we saved the penalty they bundled it in which was offside apparently drama and controversy gives them the lead in the first half Second half, we threw it away. We fell asleep. We tried to do the same thing constantly throughout the whole game. Down the left hand side, ball in the box, didn't work any time. Their defenders sussed it out every time because that's all we were trying to do all game. And then they get a goal which we basically gifted them. Some good performances in there, some bad performances in there. Macaulay Bomb once again non existent. I don't know what he's doing. I don't know why he's struggling at the moment because the first three games he's been poor. Simple as that. Not good enough. Not good enough in that game. If you don't take your chances, you don't win the game. Now let's see what Sangard, Bowyer and Gallen can do this week because I expect us to be signing a lot of players this week. We need a lot of players in before the Sunderland game if we're going to have any chance to compete with them. Ultimately, we threw it away in the second half. We should have taken the lead and should have been convincingly in front in that first half. But that penalty drama and lackadaisical defending in the second half gives Lincoln the win. And it's a frustrating afternoon, an infuriating game to watch because we just didn't take our chances. This has been Tyler Anderson. Have a nice day. See you later. Full time, Lincoln City 2, Charlton Flag 0.
We need bodies in, we need players in, and then we can start to compete. But we need to start taking our chances. See you all later.